Ed Brown, more famously known as Big Ed, from the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, has announced that he is running to be the governor of California. Despite politics being Big Ed's newfound love, his most famous love story was with Rosemary Vega from the Philippines on 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Day Season 4. Though Big Ed tried to portray himself as a kind person, his time with Vega caused him to be seen as discourteous. On different occasions, Vegas felt less than she should because of comments made by Big Ed. He constantly commented on her physical appearance. At one point, the Filipino woman was even asked to take STD tests, but Ed refused to do the same. He was also seen as controversial when he was accused of sexual harassment in his past. Big Ed's next public relationship was with Liz Woods, and it was publicized on 90 Day. The Single Life. This relationship was also a bit rocky as Big Ed tried to rush things with her. In addition to feeling like the relationship was moving too quickly, Big Ed and Woods also admitted to having steady toxic fights about things that did not matter. Eventually, one of those very toxic fights caused the two to terminate their relationship. While the two were no longer together, Ed tried to explore relationships with another woman, but this did not work. Shortly after this, Big Ed and Woods rekindled their relationship, and they are now engaged. Dot now that Big Ed is conquered making a relationship work, he is now trying to conquer the world of politics. Big Ed took to Instagram to announce that he's running for governor in the state of California. The election is taking place this year. However, his announcement was made in poor taste as the reality TV star appeared to be drunk and was also holding what seemed to be a glass of wine. As he was getting ready to end the video, Big Ed repeated that he was running to be the governor of California, but stated a different year from what he had initially said. At this point, the other members in the video reminded him of the correct year. While some of his fans supported Ed, many others expressed their disbelief in the announcement and said that Big Ed would not receive their vote. User Moni Lin commented, you really think we would want you. Dot though many thought Big Ed's post was satire, he proved them wrong by making another post with the caption, please support me as the write-in candidate for governor of the great state of California. In his original post, Big Ed shared that his platform will focus on supporting small and local businesses. Additionally, he will be focusing on ensuring that trade schools will be as recognized as colleges in the hope that people will have alternate options besides college, and he is hoping costs for these programs will be covered by the university. The reality TV star has since made regular posts on his page, but has not released any other statements or announcements concerning the gubernatorial elections or whether his announcement was truly serious. Despite the information released by the 90 Day Fiancé star, California's gubernatorial primary election will be on June 7, 2022, and the general election will be held on November 8, 2022. Even further, governors spend four years in office, which means that after this year, the next election for governor in California will be in 2026. Seeing that the candidates for the coming elections have already been solidified, it is highly unlikely that Big Ed will be stepping into a political career as a governor anytime soon, unless he really will be campaigning as a write-in candidate. Big Ed's controversial and public past is also likely to keep him from being taken seriously in the world of politics if he does decide to run for governor at some point.
Just to check it. 